Hello everyone, my name is Jeremy Holbein, and today I'm going to show you all the, my PS4 games I have. Alright, first game, Batman Arkham Knight. WWE 2K19. Ratchet & Clank Remake. God of War 2018. WWE 2K22 Red Dead 2 Kingdom Kingdom Hearts Melanie of Memory uh, GTA uh, Definitive Version Choji My friend Filthy Scumbag has the PS2 version which has like the collection of the three classic games. Uh, there's three Vice City and uh, San Andreas. So, yep. Crash, Crash, Crash. Oh, sorry, I was Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel remake from the original PS One game. GTA Five. I'm pretty sure a lot of people with a PS Four probably have this for any other console. Uh. That GTA, that GTA 5 is on. Uh, this is also a pre premium edition. Just has some little like free money you can get for online. Uh, Lego DC Villains. This is my favorite Lego DC game. All the Lego DC games. I think it actually might be my favorite um, Lego game I have I played and beat. Uh, Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2. I like the first one though. I haven't beaten this one yet, but as far I like the first Marvel Lego game better. Uh, Sonic Colors for uh, PS4. Um, this is this game was ri originally on a Wii, only on Wii and DS, but I prefer the Wii version. That's the only one I have. I used to have the DS version back then. Yeah, but this one it comes. It also comes with some like little cheat codes, or like like little free stuff you can get like. PS4 profiles and all that, or like stickers. It also comes with a, a free Baby Sonic chain, like from the movie. That you can put on your kids, but I just hang it up on my wall. Uh, Sp SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Really good game. It's a remake of the original game that was on, I'm trying to remember, I think it was on PS2, Xbox, and GameCube, I think. Uh, yeah, so it's a remake of the old, it's a remake of an old game. Which is really good. There are some glitches though I found, but they were fixed though. So yeah, uh, Sonic Mania, uh, kind of a it's kind of a remake of all like Sonic games, the old Sonic games, the two D ones. Pretty good game. And that's why DLC I haven't bought yet because I don't play that game a lot. Like this game, Spyro Re Reignite Re Reignited Trilogy, which it's a remake of. Of the original three Spyro games on PS1, which I had never played, but I played this one. I beat all three. Really good game. Next thing, uh, Nickelodeon All Star Brawl. Uh, this game is actually really fun. It, it's a Smash Brothers clone. Um, yeah, but it, it's still a really good Smash Brothers clone. It has like all the Nick characters. Not like the there's some old ones, but the one, I just wish it had ones that I actually grew up watching. There are some ones I grew up watching though, but so a lot of them aren't in this game. But they're adding like DLC though. Uh, next game, uh, WWE 2K18 uh, Deluxe Edition, which comes with a little cheat code, like a little code you can buy uh, some suitors. The bad news is the code is expired, so I couldn't really buy it. So it really sucks. Uh, good game though. It has my favorite wrestler on the cover, Seth Rollins. So that's another why I like the game. WWE 2K17. Uh, a lot of people don't like the WWE fans who like to play the games. Really don't talk about this game. I can probably see why. There's nothing really big about it. Um, but it's still a pretty good game. Uh, WWE 2K20. I, people who probably played this probably know uh, why no one really likes it. It's very glitchy and all that. Like, it's probably the worst one in the 2K series. Probably worse than 2K15. 
uh, which I call the second worst 2K game. Uh, yeah, I really don't recommend buying this. Just play 2K19 or 2K22. Uh, next game up. Disney Pixar Lego Incredibles, which is a game where you, where you play the, like, like a Lego base where you play the first movie and the second movie. For some reason, you play the second movie first instead of the first one, which I find is a weird choice, but I don't know. I didn't beat the game that all the way. I'm not even that far into the game. I just found that out. Next game, uh, Crash Bandicoot 4, It's About Time. Really good game. Difficult as hell. Um... Like, only if you're, like, trying to go for a 100% game, but it is a little pretty hard if you're just trying to, like, play through the game. Uh, it took me a lot of tries, but there are a lot of stuff that, that it gives you a lot of checkpoints, so, so that's good. Uh, really, really good game, recommend it. Uh, WWE 2K16, yeah, I have a lot of WWE games, because, you know, I'm a really big WWE fan. Uh, this is a really good game. Uh, I like, it has like a little, you play like, uh, through off, like, Stone Coast Steve Austin's, like, history's best matches, which is really fun. I really didn't play in a single match. I mostly play these games just to play the story mode. I do play with my brother sometimes. Good game. Uh, uh, WWE, uh, WWE, uh, Battlegrounds. I have a mix on this game. It's like, it's a little based on that WWE All-Stars game, like, back in, I think it was 2010. But I like the All-Stars better. I have it on Wii. I'll probably get it on Xbox 360. But I don't want to talk about that. Uh, yeah, Pretty good game. I didn't play it a lot. That's probably the last one I played like with 2K16. Uh, and that's it. Uh, to tell you my favorite. Uh, my favorite PS2 game is... I like Red Dead 2. And actually, I don't like GTA. No, I like GTA 5 better. That was my favorite. My least favorite one is... WE 2K20. And that's all my PS4 games and my thoughts about them. Uh, next, I, my next video will probably be my Wii U games. So stay tuned. Uh, subscribe. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Re, uh, leave a comment about my videos. Uh, bye.